Welcome to Palette Knife Painting. So I've toned my canvas with a very light gray tone before I begin. I'm going to put on a bit of the medium color with my brush. to get some values on my canvas. Get on a bit with the brush and then I smooth it with my paper towel, just as if I was doing a charcoal drawing. Okay, so I'm going to work from the middle out. So I put Load my palette knife with a little bit of paint on the side and I'm going to start by putting this top on. Then I'm going to spread it to get the little hump and it spreads out from there. And I put it in the middle first and then press to the sides, middle to the sides. Here we go. Okay, pull the dark underneath. Pull it underneath. Now I'm going to go for the body. So the body is the center. gray to show how the light is hitting the teapot. In this manner here. Okay. Load a bit on the edge of my brush or my knife so I can so the spot the spout comes from here. direction. So wide. Load my knife and the tip is up here. the darker gray for the handle. The handle emerges over here. Then I put some just on the edge of my knife and I go up. Now this big curve, I'm going to knife it in with straight lines. Get a nice curve. Odd, isn't it? Straight lines make a curve this way. That seems to change direction. That seems to stick back out again. Alright, I'm going to put a bit of a shadow on the inside of the spout. So first I fill in the middle, then I start working the edges. And um, it's going to be dark under here, so I need to get a little dark paint under. Okay, and it's going to be dark as it 
rows around here, but my strawberries will fit in this space here. So let's go to that. So working from the middle out, next I see my strawberry. So the strawberry is red. So I take my red paint and I'm going to make a nice red strawberry right here with the red paint. Okay, now second strawberry is a little more light on it. So I'm going to pick up um, a bit of more orange red. than the first one and the edge here is warmer, much more orange. I'm going to put in this nice orange. Then it turns to red back behind like a crescent moon shape. So I go back to my medium dark red, my red red. Alright, and then the strawberry in front is also a deep red. So I put this one in a nice red red. Oh, yeah. Alright, now this one has a little crescent moon shape for the shadow. So I'm going to mix a little bit of the deepest red and the lizarin crimson with my cabbie red and I'm going to get just a bit darker red and get that crescent moon shape in behind and crescent moon shape a bit deeper red in the back here Okay, now my little girl. My little girl has kind of a light face. So I'll put in the face first. Dot of light color. She has black hair. Put a little black. And I'll put some black on the top. Put a little black. She has a little red neck. Then she has two little arms. This way. And this way. Two little hands and a hand. The red got in there. No hand. Okay. Okay. Um, her scarf. Here and it goes across. 